All right, it's time to head on to Red Mountain and kill Dagoth Ur. So before I start, I have a few preparations to make. As you can see, I've gone back to Tel Fear, the place where I got cured of my corpus disease. And I was told in the comments section by a very nice fellow that I could steal the Quirus of the Savior's Hide from here, which I did. I went back and I unlocked this cabinet and uh, disarmed the trap and I stole it and it looks pretty good. It's got uh, protect from magic, but probably not as strong armor for me. Then I went on to cleaning off my inventory because I was being weighed down by a bunch of ebony stuff for some reason and I re-equipped some extra things like Wraith Guard, which I can't take off, and it looks amazing. I then went on to repair all my equipment because I want everything to be in tip-top shape, and I realized that Keening and Sunder are not really long blades, so my skill is a bit low. My short blade is uh, pretty decent, 30 something but my blunt weapon was like 20 so I went and trained up my blunt weapon to be 35 and then I rented a bed to sleep because I could level up and I wanted to be well rested not that there's any in game just for RP you know and I went upstairs had a rest leveled up and everything was sorted and I couldn't think of anything else I could do I had all the potions equipment gear everything's equipped and I was ready to go so I stepped out into Caldera and it was a beautiful sunny morning and I went off on pretty much my final quest for Morrowind. Fear travels. All right. Hey guys, welcome back to Morrowind Overhaul version 3.0 and I am here now after all that preparation heading on to Ghostgate because I have to, as you can see, I am wearing Wraith Guard, which I have to keep on worth 500,000 gold, of course. I have to keep that on so I can go get Sunder and Keening, two magical weapons which I need to kill Dagoth Ur. And as I approach Ghostgate here, we face terrible dangers such as rats. Anyway, Ghostgate is just over there. I have to go inside and ask them about Red Mountain. And you can see here, there's Odrasal, Dagoth Ur, and Vemin Veminal marked on my map. So I have to go to Odrasal and Veminal to get the weapons. Then I can go meet Dagoth Ur in the middle and kill him. Uh, well, kill his heart at least. So here we are at Ghostgate. I'm going to walk inside here and see what we can find. Um, I, it was also an option to kill all of the Dagoths, but... Um, ooh, a switch. That's nice. But I don't think I will need to kill all the Dagoths. Oh, that actually goes into Red Mountain. Let's go inside the building and see who we can find. In the Tower of Dusk. You want something, friend? Hello, Wolf. Maybe you know something about Ghostgate? Uh, this is a hell of a place. Why are you here? Perhaps I should keep my business secret. I'm the Neverine, and I go to confront Dagoth in his citadel. Well, Vivek said he would tell these people of my coming, so there we go. What a piece of luck! Look, I'm an old Legion veteran, as old as a poor old Emperor, bless his soul. I'm too old for campaigning. I came to this this far to look at Hell, but I can't go any further than this. I'll take it kindly if you carry this old lucky coin with you when you go to Dagoth Ur. Sort of a token of the tough young hero I used to be. Would you do that for an old man? Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, but my mother told me to never accept gifts from strangers. I'll take your old lucky coin. Why not? Old man's lucky coin has been added. That's very kind of you. Here, take the coin. I've had it with me for a long time, and it's always brought me luck. But I have no more use for it. And I'd like to pass it on to somebody younger. Somebody going places I can't go anymore. Your generation's shaper of history. An engine of destiny. That coin will bring you luck on the mountain, I promise. For emperor and empire. As we say in the legions. Go with Kinareth. Oh, okay. Poor old emperor. Emperor's getting old. 
Wolf, that's me. Okay. What is this old lucky coin? It's just an old man's lucky coin. All right. Now, let's see. Who else can we talk to? Barkeep, maybe? You have some information? Galore Salvi? Uh, barter, anything to buy? No. Um, nothing I could really ask about. Wolf, uh-huh. Okay, let's keep walking around and looking for people we could talk to. Ooh, this looks promising. Ah, someone who is... <laughs> what are you wearing? What clan are you talking about? Um, by your actions, you have lost the trust of the temple until you make amends. Oh, that's the clan. Okay, well, anyway, Ghost Fence... Ghost Fence was created and is sustained by the divine power of Vivek and the Tribunal. Okay. Ghost Gate. Garrisoned by Ordinators and the Buoyant Armagers. House Redoran maintains the ho a hostel for pilgrims. Inside the Ghost Fence. Ah, okay, here we go. All our intelligence is old. No one has ventured far inside the fence for years. This map shows the location of the citadels of the various ash vampires. Six house creatures have become more numerous and powerful, and the most powerful can conjure powerful Daedra. Until recently, we've been able to clear roots and keep them clear, clean with rays, but no longer. There are no safe refuges or services inside the fence. You must return here to rest and heal. Okay, sounds dangerous. But I think that's basically all the information I need. Um, what is that map I got? Map of Red Mountain. Ah, okay. So we can't actually... Well, actually, that doesn't really show us much at all. Does it update our map? Nope. Well, never mind. Uh, I guess we just have to head inside then. Ghost Gate is not for the weak, Outlander. Greetings, Outlander. I think I've heard of you before. Well, these look like to be pilgrims on this side of Ghost Gate. Uh, Ghost Gate is not for the weak. I'm sure it isn't. I wonder if you have any information. Nope, no new information. So, that basically means we're just gonna go into Ghost Gate and... Oh, this gate actually automatically closes. Well, are we ready? I have my weapons. As you can see, I've got the Quirus of Savior's Hide. It's light, but resist Magicka 60% is quite important. I got my Pulgens back. I'm wearing Wraith Guard, which gives me a lot of stuff. Um, so that should come in handy. Resist Magicka as well. So I think I'm as equipped as I can be. I got some potions. Maybe not as many as I should have. I've cleared my inventory of all that heavy ebony stuff. I got a lucky coin. So here we go into Ghost Gate. One more switch right here. And we are now on the other side of Ghost Gate. And it's instantly dangerous. So first stop is Odrasal, which is just northeast of here. I wonder if I can run past most of these things with my shoes. Uh, the sky is turning red while we're here. Okay, let's try run past them so we can save as much of our energy as possible and head straight to Odrasal. Perhaps I should ring of floating. Oh, they're already attacking me. Oh, we'll kill you. Just for good luck, we'll kill the first guy in here. Come on, then. That's right. Ooh, long blade, blade increased. Ah, nice. And, well, <laughs> this is Red Mountain. It's pretty red, all right. Well, northeast it is to the first location. I think it should be just up here. What? There's actually shrines. Ghost Gate Shrine. Here, Vivek, Sothasil, and Amalexia used many soul gems to create the Ghost Fence, an unwavering symbol of Dunmer pride. Oh, a nice bit of lore, just on a side route though. Cliff races are here as well, damn it. I prefer fighting these corpus things than those cliff races. Well, let's just run right past as much as possible. Perhaps I should be using my Ring of Floating. Oh wow, there's these ogre things too. Um. This is not what I'm looking for. Odrasal, I think it was. Oh, cliff racers. They're really fast. Oh, corpus monster. Okay, it should be just over here. And... A bit further northeast. I can't find it. Where is it? Oh, Daedra. Surely I've reached it by now. Is it? Ah, get off me. I think it's just up this hill. Come on, die, Cliff Racer. Why can't I hit you? Okay, well, I guess I just have to use a ring of floating to float over to... Ah, that must be it. 
Okay, here we go. This must be Odrasal. Now, is there a way in? Nice door. This will do. Odrasal, Dwemer Training Academy. Hmm, fascinating. What was that? Did someone say die? I didn't see the subtitles. Okay, anyway. Uh, we have to search this place for one of the weapons. Mm-hmm. I'm guessing it's gonna be super dangerous. This what? There's already... Oh, there's... <laughs> well, that person's coming up here. I think that's a golden saint, actually. What's with all these dead people? Come on, golden saint. Here we go. Where do you think you're going? I'm over here. Come on. Yeah. I can take you. Golden Saints. Now there's plenty of loot in here which I could take. Glass tower shield, ebony short sword, but I really want to keep myself lightweight as possible. But who are you? Skeletal corpse with seven gold. <laughs> okay, um, drum a door. Oh, that looks like a Dagoth to me. Come on, gonna cast a spell? Come on then. <laughs> These guys are not pleasant looking. How do you even end up looking like that? What the hell? What? Oh. Did he just hit... Did he just one-shot me? Wow, okay, this might be a lot tougher than I expected. Okay, here we are back in... Um, this place. We got that golden saint to kill. Now, is that Dagoth gonna one-hit me once again? Uh, I really don't know. Well, let's deal with this Golden Saint first, which is pretty straightforward. So, um, there's a Daedric Shield I could take. Is that actually better than... No, what I'm wearing is better. Okay, so, um, hmm. I know this Quirus of Savior's Hide has Resist Magicka, but my Drew Quirus has more armor rating, so I'm gonna put that on right now because he one-shotted me. Now, uh, let's see if we can deal with him. Where is he? There he is. Uh, do we have any any spells we can use? Anything that will protect us? I don't think so. We're just gonna have to fight him. Come on then. Well, let's uh, throw a shock ball at him. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> Come on, then. Are you gonna one-shot me? Come on, then. Can I get you stuck on the door? I just have to back away every time I hit him. Ah, yes. Come on, stagger. Yes. Die. Ah, ooh. Oh, he hit me, but he didn't one-shot me. Okay, good. Dagoth Odros, you are dead. Uh, <laughs> six house amulet drain personality. Let's not take that. Amulet of heart fire, fortify agility and armored chameleon 20% uh, on self. Uh, this is all on cast when used, but I'm gonna take that anyway. And a Dagoth Odros key. All right, um, so where? There's that guy up there. Dead dreamer. Large wrapped corpus meat. Why would you wrap corpus meat? Okay, good. I killed him. And there's that flaming guy on top. Now, where's the, where's this key gonna be used? Here? Ah, yes, okay, the key was used on that door. So we are just looking for that weapon. Doesn't seem to be here. In this chest, ornate Dwemer chest. No, where do you think it is? Odrasal tower, maybe? The tower looks good, uh-oh, okay. Nothing here. Ah, that looks important. Let's see. Keening, yes! Short blade, one-handed, fortify magicka, health, attack, agility, speed, all on self. My journal has been updated. Uh, oh, I actually didn't see the the journal update for this. Uh, it is This is the lucky coin. Strange, but I have a feeling I know that this encounter has marked my fate and fortune. You have gained a new power, luck of the emperor. What's that? Hmm. Well, it must be good. 
In Citadel Odrasal, I discovered the artifact blade Keening, one of the enchanted tools created by Dwemer Craft Lodge Kagranak. Alright, so we have Keening. Where is it? Weapons. Uh, there we go. Keening. Short blade, one-handed. Not very damaging, but very magical. Now, next, I have to head up to Veminal to get Sunder. But first, we gotta get out of this area, which that guy's still trying to kill me, I think. But that shouldn't be too much of a problem. I don't think he can get down here. There's actually a lot of areas around here. But we killed that Dagoth. Let's head back out into the Red Mountain region. Nothing attacking us instantly. And now we head northwest past the center of Red Mountain to Veminal. Well, we're almost there, but things, mainly cliff races, are constantly attacking us. For some reason, the sky is a little clearer here. Now, it should be just west of here, past these two cliff races, which are undoubtedly gonna disturb me. Come on, then. Ah. Uh, die. And you too. Jeez. Red Mountain, home of the cliff races. Uh, where is it? On the map, it says it's like right here. Let's check the local map. I don't see it. Veminal should be like right around here. What's that thing? Oh, <laughs> it's one of those. I've never actually fought one though. Come on then. Yes. That's you dealt with. Hunger. Deja Hearts, yeah, we don't need that. It's not that, is it? We're still inside Ghost Gate. Ooh. Ah, that must be it. Right down this little valley. Rats, how do you survive in this area? Surely things would eat you. Ah, this looks like it. Lots of sleepers, lots of cliff races, sky is going red again. Come on then. Ah, we'll deal with these things as much as possible. Come on, sleepers. Oh, actually, no, you're not a sleeper, are you? What are you? Ash zombies, of course. You had a spike club. You should use it next time. Another one over there. Get the high ground. Yes. Okay, now. Um, what's that? Okay, so where's the entrance to this place? Do you see a door? I don't really see a door. Is it up there? Let's check the local map. This must be it. Yes, yes, yes. This is definitely it. But I can't find the door. Hmm. Maybe I just have to float up. And maybe it's up here? Ah, that looks like it. Veminal Outer Fortress. Perfect. So inside here is, or well, should be, Sunder. Looks like there's a lot of bad guys. Which uh, we'll try to deal with as much as possible. Oh, crap. Let's kill you. Oh, the, the face of the world could do without your face. Jeez. Ah. Come on then. Okay, dealt with them. Now, Dagoth Garel, you didn't have anything on you, did you? Ornate chest, any treasure, dwarven battle axe. Uh, nothing I could really use. A bunch of Dwemer weapons. Um, I really should heal up. Let's see. Where's my hearth heal spell? Let's heal up a bit. One more of those. Okay, perfect. Now, let's go find that weapon and the other Dagoth. Well, there's some treasure here that seems a little nice. Rubies, Dwemer coins, we'll take that. Uh, Dwarven short sword, no. There's this letter, parchment with scrawlings. All cries are waking, whitest white of all white, blackest blacks of all black. Shame and sun's sun and shadow, stronger than gods, brighter than mortals, only he is awake, only he is alive. He knows the names and the naming, he knows the wait and the waiting, he enters into every star and moon, he shines through their shadows. One shape, one spelling, one wraith, one casting, from darkness he is armed, from light he is warded. He is all things, Drake, Lich, Theoman. On rivers of fire he comes forth, through storms of dreams he rides. With slivers of steel he pierces the heart, 
All spells, powers, curses broken, the chains are shattered, the scales fall away. I see you with my eye, and all is silence. I wake, I remember, Lord. I'll take that, that's a lovely poem. <laughs> well, there's a few books here which aren't really much. Some potions, which uh, exclusive potion of shadow, okay. Detect creatures, I don't really need this stuff. Fire resistance, you never know. Fortify speed, maybe. Slow falling, drain agility for 40 seconds. Oh, uh, no, I got my ring of floating for that. Well, I'm just heading deeper into this cavern. Hall of Torque, that sounds pretty dangerous. Let's head in there then. Whoa, instant danger. Come on then. I hope nothing's at the sides. Just this guy? Yeah, okay, he's not doing too much damage. Ah, I hate getting up in those guys' faces. Ah. Anything else coming? I hear footsteps. Dagoth Felmis. Six house amulet. Yeah, your personality... Well, you don't really need that amulet to drain your personality. I don't think anyone's gonna walk up to you and say hi. Anyway, looking through the cracks, that looks like an important room. It's all red and stuff. So, let's just save up here. Okay, now into... Well, we'll just open one of these doors. Do you see Dagoth? I don't see him. Okay, it's just some banners. Oh, that looks important. I don't see Sunder, though. Let's just try head through the center. Oh, that's not quite Dagoth, just a Dramora Lord. Take care of him. I don't exactly know where I'm going. I'm just heading straight. And usually straight and down is the good way to go. And now we're downstairs, I think. Come on, then. Yeah. Take care of you. Is this an ash zombie? No, this isn't an ash zombie, is it? It's a... Oh, it is actually a Dagoth. Dagoth Solar. Ghoul heart. Ew. Um, well, we're in this room. Oh, that. <laughs> the main Dagoth is down here. Now, I'm worried he's gonna one-shot me like the other guy. Um, his pathfinding's a little weird. Hmm. Let's, uh... If you're gonna be stuck there, let's throw one of these at you. Why? Spell casting and morrowing is such a pain. Okay, here he comes. Come on. I just have to make sure he doesn't hit me too hard. I can't hit him. Come on. Dagoth Venom. Yes, I staggered you. Take the opportunity. Whoa, casting spell. Hide behind the door. Swing right across the face. Dagoth Venom, you are dead and you are holding Sunder. Wow, okay. Um, let's take Sunder then. Boom, and Amulet of Hearth Heal. I have a spell of Hearth Heal. What is this amulet? Does it just, uh... It's a bit better. Alright, cool. We now have Sunder. Um, I think I could actually end this here because I might want to save the main fight with Dagoth, uh, for the next episode. But let's get out of here first. Okay, well, that's the end of this episode. My journal should have updated me. In Citadel Verminal, I discovered the artifact hammer Sunder, one of the enchanted tools created by the Dwemer craft lord Kragrinak. Huh. I'm gonna end this episode here, and in the next episode, the final episode, I will head on to Dagoth Ur and kill him and his stupid heart. Ah, uh, well, thank you so much for watching. The finale coming up pretty soon, actually. Alright, that's it for this episode. I'll see you in the next video.